Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Captain Shaq. This video is everything you need to know about the reliable Aurora 2944 in all its variations. One of the best all-purpose ships in Star Citizen. Once you've watched this briefing, I highly recommend you head back to the main spectrum menu located here for further information on everything you need to know about Star Citizen. Those that make it in the verse, and I mean really make it, know how to adapt. They can change to fit any situation. From combat to hauling duty to deep space exploration, few ships can handle more than one of these jobs, let alone all three. The Aurora can not only do each of these jobs, it can do them safely. Holding the highest safety rating for any starship of its weight class and more upgrades than even the Anvil Hornet, the Aurora is the ship for the aspiring captain that wants to do a little bit of everything. All Auroras come standard with one of the best cockpit designs, giving the pilot a fantastic level of visibility. Two standard C-12A class docking rings allow for easy docking with the majority of stations and larger spacecraft, and the ship comes equipped with a single person full length sleeping berth for those extra long distance flights. Let's see a Hornet pilot try that. RSI has designed all Aurora variants with the ability to do just about anything the pilot can come up with, utilizing a vast array of upgrade options. Having the power out of the factory to carry five tons of cargo when equipped with a store all mini cargo container, and the firepower to protect that cargo. Using a single class three weapon hardpoint normally reserved for quad missile rack and two class one gimbal mounted gun hardpoints. The basic Aurora can dish out a lot of pain and that's not even the combat variant. Speaking of, let's see what RSI has to offer in the way of options. The Aurora comes in five variants straight out of the factory. The Essential is the perfect starter and exploration ship, the most basic model, rocking a pair of nose-mounted Nightbridge 9 Series long swords and a single S2 quad missile rack on the roof. She comes standard with a store-all mini container installed under the rear of the hull, giving her ample storage space. The Aurora Mark has all the same stats as the Essential, but packs more combat capability with a beefier power supply and a pair of Brigham M3A lasers, giving it a bit more punch. The Aurora Clipper is perfect for a trader, businessman, or entrepreneur. Swapping out for a smaller power plant and less armor, she's got an expanded cargo bay to carry more goods. The Aurora Legionnaire is one of the most combat capable craft on the market, adding a larger shield generator and a pair of additional hard points to the wings. The Legionnaire can take and dish out way more punishment than any other Aurora in the lineup. Lastly, the Aurora LX. The LX is the deluxe model of the Aurora. Powerful engines with a level one overdrive, a good shield, offensive weapons, and high upgrade capability make up for its high price tag. The Aurora LX can be easily modified for the individual's needs. Often enough, it's used for exploration and light merchantile work. RSI is all about convenience, making the Aurora a ship you can easily upgrade, swap parts out, and maintain. Even more impressive is these same upgrades can be swapped out and used in RSI's other ship, the massive best-in-class multi-crewed constellation. So for those with lofty goals of captaining one of these big beasts, remember, anything you buy for the little single-seat fighter can be shared with your constellation. Convenience, power, customization. The Aurora gets it done. To find out more about Star Citizen, head on over to the main menu by clicking the link here and choose another video. If you're interested in more single seat ships, check out the 300i video or the badass Hornet military fighter. As always, watch your six and thanks for watching.